So the next question is, what is your favorite ex um blah, blah, blah. I'm dreaming of white Christmas. Hey guys, so I'm back again with another video and today's video is going to be the winter tag. I'm so excited because I love winter so much. Um, I knew about the winter tag from a while ago, but I decided that I wanted to do it this month for you guys. That being said, I was on YouTube looking at different channels that were doing it, and I found Harmony Nice's video, and I really loved her video, and I love the set of questions that she used, so I will be using that too. Right here are the questions, and I will be answering those for you guys, so let's get started. My camera's still not fixed, so... I am sorry guys in advance. I borrowed my cousins, but I said no. Okay. <laughs> Question one. What are your favorite things about winter? I just love winter. Winter has always been a great time for me all the way from when I was such a young child till now. I love the season. I think it's so romantic and not the relationship kind, but the kind where you just get to experience so many different great things and that's what winter has always brought for me. Whether it's the different kind of activities that I get to do by myself or with friends and meeting new people, I've just always loved this time of the year and I just love the snow on the ground and on houses. It's so pretty. It's just, yeah, I love winter. Number two, what is your favorite winter outfit? I would like I would like to say that I love wearing a cozy pair of jeans or a cozy pair of leggings with a warm pair of socks and a nice cozy sweater. That is the perfect winter outfit for me. Number three, my favorite winter food. I don't necessarily have a favorite winter food, but there's some specialty foods in Canada that I love. That includes beaver tails and if you are Canadian you know what that means it's a pastry that resembles a beaver tail and with brown sugar on it and you can put other things on it, it just tastes really good that and frozen syrup on a stick that tastes amazing weird treats but I love them My favorite drink, winter drink, is hot chocolate and tea, and my favorite place to get it is at Starbucks, and that is a, an amazing white hot chocolate with whipped cream on top. The next question is, what is your dream way to spend a winter's day? And like I told you guys, I love winter, so any winter activity would be an amazing winter day for me. That being said, not skiing because I was involved in two accidents, which left me unconscious and I have a little bit of a fear right now. That being said, anything. Earlier this year in February, I went snowshoeing with a group of girls that I've never met before, and I had an amazing time. They were all great girls, and I would love to do it again. And yeah, I just, those are the experiences that I yearn for during this time of the year. The next question is, how do you like to wear your makeup in the, win in the winter? And I don't. I don't really wear makeup to begin with, but when I do, I wear whatever I want. I love, love, love wearing lipsticks whenever I feel the energy to put some on. And I have a lot of dark colors, which I hear works great for the winter, or for the colder months, I should say. And what are you hoping Santa brings to you is the next question, and I don't, again, I don't think Santa's going to be bringing me anything this year, but if he wants to, I really would like a new camera. That would make my day, and I would be good forever. So, yeah. The next question is, what are the first three things that remind you of winter? And number one is... Why did I forget? Number one is winter attire and winter items in stores. That's how I know winter is coming. Number two, the snow, obviously. Number one should be snow, actually. And number three, the Christmas movies. That's how I know it's going to start becoming winter here in Canada. So those are the three things that remind me of Christmas immediately. And I love winter so much. 
The next question is, what is your favorite winter song? And I have two. And one's a Christmas song, and one is not a Christmas song. So, so I can't speak right now. So the first one is Mariah Carey's "Baby, All I Want for Christmas Is You." And I tried the singing thing. We know it doesn't work now. And then I love Taylor Swift's "Back to December All the Time." And we tried the singing thing again, and we know it didn't work. But I will continue to sing. Anyways, those are my favorite winter songs. I love them. I love them. So the next question is, what is your favorite winter memory? And I would have to say that was in grade 6 and 8 when I went to Quebec in grade 6 and Ottawa in grade 8. And that was from my school's French curriculum. I had so much fun, such a great experience. Not only just because I got the chance to practice French, being away from my parent, um, you know, just the experience at all of getting to be in a different area. Everything was amazing. I loved it. I hope this opportunity is there for... Um, kids of that age when you know as time goes on and you know if you were born in Ontario Canada or went to school here you might have had that experience and then my next favorite experience was going away snoo snowshoeing with the group of girls from my Facebook travel group that was also a lot of fun and the second last question is what is your favorite winter scent and I don't care if anyone judges me but that is a perfectly good made with love White hot chocolate from Starbucks, like that smell is to die for. And then I also like the smell of tree bark. I don't know why, it just smells amazing, like so amazing. Like that is also to die for. Talk about good smelling things. And last but not least, this is the last question and it's to finish this sentence. If I could have one winter wish, it would be to have a functioning camera yes a functioning camera and all jokes aside all i want is a relaxing time with family and friends getting the time to get rest before the new year starts and getting back to work and the grind and the hustle because right now the diet is out the door if i ever had one to begin with and there you have it guys, that was the winter tag. And I thank you guys for watching my video. And yeah, um, again, I'm sorry for the jumping in this video. And you know, earlier when I said I wasn't gonna use my cousin's camera, it was because when I was testing it out, um, the screen on my camera is much bigger than the screen on her camera. And putting it into the editing software, it was definitely noticeable. And I thought I didn't want that for my channel, but that might have to happen because there's one video I have to do for you guys before the end of the year, and I will not accept any jumping in the video for that. So, yes, thank you for watching again. I love you guys so much. And I will talk to you guys later.